captain uh, ahead of the qualifiers how's the team shaping up uh, team shaping up pretty well i think uh, we have a kind of a good uh, pre tour in oman i think the oman yeah. cricket academy treating us pretty well so overall it's a good show till now and you played some uh, unofficial matches ahead of the tournament in the this surrounding so how's the how has the uh, training session been so far uh, it's been difficult a little bit in the starting especially coming straight from the indoors uh, back home it's uh, like snowing right now and the temperature in, in minus so right now i think everybody is set up uh, everybody is kind of uh, uh, settled down with the environment and everything so we are ready to go so how do you see the opponents in your group uh, opponents are actually pretty well uh, i think especially uh, game against Oman and Nepal gonna be very tough so we're looking forward to it uh, the, uh, Oman and uh, Nepal are considered to be outright favorite, but Canada is close behind. So, how, what, what, how do you see the game against uh, Philippines as well? Because th that's the way you start the tournament. It is like all the ICC games, especially it's uh, all about the momentum. And uh, uh, I think the game against Philippines is also equally important. Uh, who knows at the end it comes on a run rate or something. So, any game in T20, it's important. So we'll. So we're just trying to be focused on all the games. How do you see the game against Nepal? Because you've, you've, said you've got some players who have played in Nepal, domestic cricket as well. So how do you see Nepal, Nepal as an opponent? Uh, we see, see uh, how the Nepal is doing in uh, especially the series before they did. So I think uh, they're pretty balanced side, especially their fielding skills. So we're very impressed with that. But other than that, it's a T20 game. So whoever gets the momentum, they're going to win the game. Uh, overall, how, how, what are the chances you see yourself making it to the finals of this tournament and ultimately the World Cup? Uh, we are here to win. We all know how important it is for Canada. Uh, we know for the other people maybe it's just a tournament to be in the uh, be in the group or play another World Cup. For us, it's a make and break. So, so we're looking at like that and we'll play accordingly. Talking about make and break, uh, we can go back to 2018 where uh, Nepal and Canada had a very memorizing game. So, where does where does this game rank? How important it is for Canada's future for the cricket? It seemed like that we kind of lost that important game, and uh, you know it takes about what two to three years to get all the players back. We lost some players. We have some new players. So it takes about a good two to three years to make a good team again. So overall, uh, you, 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 uh, there are good teams in other group too. So who, who do you see as the strongest team in this World Cup qualifier, A and B? Uh, I think Ireland looks pretty well shaped up. Uh, other than that, UAE, they are playing some wonderful cricket. Uh, Oman has a home advantage. So at the end, I said it again, it's T20 games. On its day, anybody can win.